Hello children. Today we are going to learn a new poem in English, Unit 8. And the name of our poem is The Sun. As you can see in the picture here, this is a picture of a sun which we see every day in the sky. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. And sun gives us heat and light. Now let us see a poem on the sun. The poet who has written this poem, his name is John Drinkwater. John Drinkwater. He is the poet of this poem. Poet means someone who writes the poem. So this poem is written by John Drinkwater. Let's begin. The sun. Listen and repeat. I told the sun that I was glad. Glad means happy. So the poet is telling us that he said to the sun that the poet was happy. I'm sure I don't know why. The poet was not sure but why he was happy. But he was sure that he is happy. But he doesn't know the reason why he was happy. Somehow the pleasant way he had of shining in the sky. So the poet is telling that he is happy because the sun has a very pleasant way, a very happy way. Pleasant means happy. A very happy way of shining in the sky. Just put a notion in my head. Notion means idea or thought. So just put a notion in my head that wouldn't it be fun? So the poet is saying that it just put a notion in my head, in his head, the th thought came that wouldn't it be fun if walking on the hill I said I am happy to the sun. So walking on the hills, as you can see the picture, this is a hill. It's a small mountain is called as hill. So walking on the hill, the poet said to sun that I am happy. Let us repeat the poem one more time. The sun. Listen and repeat. I told the sun that I was glad. I'm sure I don't know why. Somehow the pleasant way he had of shining in the sky. Just put a notion in my head that wouldn't it be fun if walking on the hill I said I'm happy to the sun. This written by John Drink Water. Now we will solve this exercise. Write the rhyming words. Rhyming words means the words which have similar sounds. So we have to search for the rhyming words. The first word is why. As you can see in the textbook here, this is the word why. The rhyming word for why is sky. So we will write sky. As See the it's ending with why. Here sky is also ending with why. So we will write here sky. Number two now. Let's see. Glad. So now we have to write the rhyming word for glad. So the rhyming word for glad is had. H-A-D. See both are ending with A-D. A-D. So glad had. So we will write here had. Let's see the next one. Fun. F-U-N. Fun. So the rhyming word for fun is sun. Fun is also ending with U-N and sun is also ending with U-N. Fun, sun. So we write here sun. Next is head. H-E-A-D. Head. Now we have to search for a rhyming word for head. Head, said. See both are ending with D. So rhyming word for head is said. As it has a similar sound. Head set. 
Now let us complete the next activity. Look at the picture and fill in the blanks using words given in the bracket. So here the bracket is there where there are some words given. Eating, climbing, singing, shining. So we have to look at these pictures and use the words given in the bracket to complete the sentences. The sun is dash in the sky. Now what is the sun doing in the sky? Sun is shining in the sky. So we will write here shining. Next, Raj is dash a ladder. So as you can see in the picture, what is Raj doing? Raj is climbing a ladder. So we write here climbing. Next word, John is dash a song. What is John doing in this picture? Yes, John is singing. So we take this word from here and we will write here singing. Jenny is dash a banana. See, look at Jenny. What is she doing? She is eating. So we take this word eating and we will write here E A T I N G eating a banana. So children in this way with the help of this video you will complete page number 72 in your Balbhati textbook and practice reciting the poem The Sun. Thank you.